Hey guys, this is Rusty78609 in Central Texas, USA, and look what's right in front of me. I got my new toilet installed. I've been RVing for over 25 years. I've probably installed half a dozen of these things. But the last one was a total disaster because of the hookups in the back. But this little El Cheapo from Walmart is very easy to install. And I'll give you the name of it again in just a minute. This is part two of two. It is a foot flush Thetford. Again, if you have a list, don't try to say that. And there's the little diagram. But here's what you do. See down here on the bottom? There's a little foot thing there. You, you press down a little bit, and it lets water in. See? And then you press it all the way down, and it flushes. Okay? That's that. So you want to keep a little water in there all the time, because that keeps it sealed and keeps all those nasty little gases from coming into your home. But that's it, baby. This puppy works. And there's the little foot flush. The little lid is cheap plastic, but that's fine with me. I don't care. And back here, I'll show you. It all worked. All the little hookups work. I just hand tighten it. This right here is that uh, shark something. You just push it into the PVC pipe. I th it's a hard plastic, but you just push it in there. This hose I had pre-connected. I got it at Ace Hardware. And then it goes right up here and hooks to the back of the toilet. And that's the only thing that hooks to the toilet right here. Okay? And, I, and this is plastic. This black part right here is plastic. So do not use a wrench to tighten it. I, I just hand tightened it. That's all that is. There's not a single drop of water coming. It's not leaking. So just hand tighten it and it's good to go. And hallelujah. The wicked witch is dead. Remember the Wizard of Oz? Well, the wicked old witch was the toilet that didn't work here. So having said that, now we'll go outside and... I'll show you what kind it is in case you want to get one. It's $130 delivered, including sales tax in Texas, which is about 6.5% where I live. And there it is right there. It is a Thetford, Thetford, don't say it if you got a list, Magic 5. This, I got the tall one, and they make a small, a shorter one that's about 4 inches shorter, or 3 inches. And uh, But anyway, it works. There it is right here, all the specs on it. AMI high foot white CP blah 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 Okay, and that's what it looks like and it's real easy. It weighs about 10 pounds So it's easy to handle this one over here the one I'm replacing because I made a mistake one of my many uh, This has a porcelain bowl. Do I give a crap about that? No, it weighs a ton and this, these fittings, you should have seen how they had this water hose hooked up. But anyway, what I did when I put the fitting on here, I tightened it with a wrench and stripped it out. And that is, you cannot, you can't remove this and get another one, okay? Now there's a lot of things you could do. You could get a PVC piece and put on there and glue on there and do all that stuff, but hell with it. I ain't going to fool with it. That's all there is to that crap. That's a good way to say it, isn't it? Because that's what it's all about, isn't it? Taking the crap. So, anyway, that's it, guys, from Central Texas, USA. Let me take, give you a couple more tips. I'll go back in and look at this beautiful toilet. $130 from Walmart. Delivered, UPS, my lovely home, my 26-foot travel trailer, Jayco J Flight in Central Texas, USA, on July the 19th, 2017. And there it is, babe. That puppy is good to go. That's a flushing machine. So, for the first time in, uh, what? Let's see. 14 days I'll be able to use a flush toilet okay won't that be interesting because I went on a camping trip and I've been using a three-legged camping toilet and now I'm back to modern conveniences but anyway guys if you install a, to a toilet yourself hand tighten the nut on the toilet okay hand tighten it hand tighten it hand tighten it because if you use a wrench now if you have to use a wrench maybe you're not strong or whatever I'm not strong either trust me on that uh, then just, tw you know, if you got a little leak, just tweak it a little bit, maybe a quarter of a turn with a wrench. Because it they strip out very, very easily, and once you've done it, there's no recovering, okay? So anyway, thumbs up, carpe diem, adios. Bye, 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 USA made. Was this made in the USA? I have no clue. I just know it's cheap. And, uh, and I could get it quick. Uh, what else? Uh, take deep breaths, breathe in through your nose, out through your mouth several times a day, relieve stress. Uh, drink plenty of water that'll help you avoid gout and kidney stones and it also keeps you healthy in many other ways the whole thing's about keeping your health because would I be doing this if I wasn't healthy enough no I wouldn't be fooling with it. I'm 72 years old okay but anyway enjoy your day guys adios the wicked witch is dead and the new queen has uh, the throne the new throne has arrived bye anyway bye